Good morning. Welcome to Get Ready With Me. My name is Jennifer Woolsey and I'm a top leader with Avon. And we are going to chat and do our makeup today. So I hope you're doing great. Welcome in and say hello whenever you hop in. Be sure and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about these quick mommy makeup tips. And if you don't see a live, then hashtag replay. So let's do this. So I've already gone in with my morning skincare regimen. Um, I'm still using my Dual Elixir and my Skin Invincible Day Cream, as well as my Depuffing Eye Serum. But I've learned a new trick. I um, have battled with pore size, so I started using our new clinical line eraser with retinol at night um, because I learned that retinol will help to decrease your pore size. So if pore size is an issue that you struggle with, then you definitely, definitely want to add some retinol into your um, skincare regimen. So I'm excited to see what kind of results I get. I've already done my primer. I'm using Ink Lasting Primer to also help minimize those pores and cut down on the oil. Um, and then we are going to, we're gonna go ahead and do our concealer. Magic's Wand and Marshmallow. So I was reading an article that was talking about the benefits of retinol on your skin and how um, the active ingredients in it can help to um, minimize your pores, make them smaller, and um, make them appear uh, to be less in, of an issue. So I've been using it about a week now. I think I can honestly see a difference. Uh, I think it's, you know, it's something that you've got to give it some time to work with your body. And we're gonna go in now. I'm gonna do that concealer. This, in a darker shade, can also be used as a foundation stick. So Magic's Wand is definitely a go-to. All right, what do we do next? What do we do next? <laughs> next is our Ink Lasting Primer. I've been watching some different YouTube videos where they are um, doing like their eye makeup first and then, um, so I'm putting that in and pushing it down and picking up my product um, eyeshadow first and then they go in and do their makeup after. And I think that's because they have a lot of fallout on their makeup, on their eyeshadow. So it's leaving um, like debris and stuff on their face and so... I don't really have that problem with our Avon makeup and eyeshadow, so, um, which is what I use. I'm not really gonna, not gonna really mess with that. I like to stay in my regular order. So what order do you put your um, concealer and your foundation on and then your eyeshadow? Because everybody does it a little bit different. I can't imagine doing my eyes first and then having to work around it. That just seems odd to me, doesn't it? Come on. So I'm blending the under eye with my pad here. The cool thing about this ink lasting is that you can build it up. So if you need a little bit more coverage, you can also do another dip, pick up a little bit more and just build, build, build. One layer seems to be plenty for me, <clears throat> and it feels so light, like, you don't even feel like anything's on your face, which is something I'm very thankful for, because I don't like that thick, like, mask feeling on my face, so. All right, we are going to do these brows now. So what are you thankful for? I know I've already done one video about thankfulness, but I think this is something that warrants two videos. And next week is going to be crazy mayhem. Not sure I'm going to get to do my makeup with you very much because the kids are out of school. And as you know, I work from home mom. So if they don't have to get up and get dressed, guess what? I don't have to get up and get dressed. Thankful. <laughs> Thankful for that. Thankful for days out of school, and my I have some family coming in. My younger sister and her family 
are coming in, um, which is super exciting. I'm so thankful for that. Um, we haven't all got, our families all gotten to be together um, since we lost our mom about two years ago. So that's going to be fun. Lots of fun. Excited. Um, and then, you know, of course, we're all working on the recipes, all the things you got to have for Thanksgiving, you know. What are your favorites? We're going to one. Translucent loose powder now. Just dusting it on. Gonna set just a little bit. If you will take just a little bit of your loose powder and kind of really concentrate on that under eye, it will help lighten up those areas. See those dark bags don't look as bad now. Much better. Yay, the magic of makeup. <laughs> Because, you know, we haven't been sleeping too well around here lately. All right. So, for our eyeshadow today, I'm so excited. We're using the Oh What Fun Palette. It has 66 eyeshadow shades, you guys. The pigmentation in these are amazing. Watch. Boom. Look at all those colors. And then, you also have highlighters and blushes and lip glosses. Wah! All of those colors. So, we are going to use this palette today. And today, I think we're going to pull some, we're going to pull a little bit of burgundies. So, I'm going to go in with this lightest shade here and do my base with it. Now, if your makeup does tend to have a little bit of fallout, you can just tap your brush and look onto your sink and that will help with the fallout. When I say fallout, I mean like things falling on your face. That's what fallout is. Okay, so we went in with that lightest shade. Now we're going to go in with, I'm going to pull this burgundy right here. Uh, yeah, we'll pull this one first. I'm going to do that in the crease. Starting at the outside, and I'm just working it in, in that crease area. Work it, work it, work it. Okay. Same on this side. The um, pigmentation is really good. It's a deep, this is kind of a deep burgundy color. I love it. Love it. Working it into that crease, so to give that a little bit of highlight. And then I'm going to go back and I'm going to pick up um, this maroon that's kind of right next to it. And I'm just going to work that bottom part and blend it with my crease. It just gives it like an appearance of like dark, uh, medium dark, and then lightest. Kind of like a fade into which I'm crazy about. I'm here for it. So I'm thankful for so many things today. I'm thankful for my business. I'm blessed to be able to work from home. Um, today, my son has a field trip with his class, my oldest, <clears throat> and he hasn't been feeling 100%. So I'm going to go back on the top with that lightest. And so I get to go with him. That is the blessing of working from home is... I can still do my job and be a mom. So, very thankful for that today. What do you think? Okay. While I've got the palette out, we're going to go ahead and use the highlighter in this um, and do just a little bit of highlight. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I'm going to pick up this shade right here. We're going to do more contouring with it. What do you think? Whoa! Whoa! Okay, yes, girl. You are getting this. We're learning. <laughs> okay, so if you think you need to blend that just a little bit, you can take your little Ruby Cell Puff and blend, blend, blend. Or you can take your powder brush and use that to blend. Perfect. 
perfecto. Now we're going to go in. We're going to use this brush as it's a buffing brush. Maybe. Yeah, we'll use it. It'll be fine. I was looking uh, for my blush brush, but we're going to use this one. No, we're not. <laughs> it's going to go on too high concentrated. Okay, we're going to use the blush brush and pick up just a little bit of this brown blush. There we go. Do you hold your face funny whenever you do your blush? Wow, girl. Woo. She is here for it. Okay. So we've got the eyes done. The eyes have it. What do you think? We could, if I was like, lots of extra time here. We could go with, and I don't, um, pick up a little bit of that lighter shade of eyeshadow. And I tend to have a little bit of purpling on the inner eye and just pick that up there. It's also going to give it a little bit of a glimmer um, and help pull the light away from your eyes. So let's do our liquid eyeliner in super extend. This stuff goes on beautifully. It has a beautiful color payoff. It just lays right on the eyes. So pretty. Okay, so I just went about halfway on that bottom eye. So I'm gonna try something different with my eyeshadow that I haven't done before. Okay, so I'm gonna take my eyeshadow brush and I'm gonna take that lighter shade. I'm gonna mix this one and this one just a tad. I'm gonna kind of here we go. Just blend that a little bit under the eye. Just to soften that line just a little. I like it. What do you think? Okay, good deal. Now we're gonna curl these lashes and get them curled up. Curl, curl, curl. Maybe. I don't like grabbing too much of my, there we go, there we go, perfect. These lashes, or these brows are really bugging me today. Not sure why they don't want to be tamed. <laughs> Love mascara, of course, is my go-to mascara. It has heart-shaped fibers that attach to the lashes gloves on them. Perfect. Okay. And now we'll do the other eye. And that's just one coat, guys. That's not like, you know, having to go back in like 20 times. I somehow messed up these lashes on the bottom and I've lost several. So I'm not sure. Go back in with a second coat. I'm not really sure what I've done. So I'm using my lash serum, actively using it to help lengthen and for new lash growth at night. Let me show you. It is really simple to put on. You just paint it on your eyelashes and just kind of rub it in. No, it doesn't burn your eyes. It's 
doesn't hurt anything really works pretty well so okay well we've got that look I've got to get this hair finished um, let's use tenacious in our liquid matte this morning There we go. All right, guys, we're going to get this hair finished up and then we will be off for the day. I hope that you are thankful for all the blessings that you have. So take a minute today and just count your blessings and tell those around you that you love them and that you are thankful for them. Thanks for watching. If you want to shop for any of these products, you can get them at your avon.com slash jwolsey. Um, use code welcome10 and get a 10% discount. And share this video. Sharing is caring, and I appreciate you watching. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.